Hello folks, this is Riva here, hope you're doing well. Today's video is about the Final Fantasy VII Remake trailer and more precisely about Red 13. I noticed something very strange about Red 13 that I wanted to discuss with you guys. Um, we saw a lot of new things in the trailer, new areas, um, new character interactions, new battle scenes. We, all, we even saw a new Simone, but what we didn't see was Red 13 actually being involved in any of the battles as a playable character. So uh, I wanted to show you guys uh, two pictures, um, Exhibit A and Exhibit B. Let me pull up the first one. The first picture um, shows Tifa, Aerith and Cloud fighting Genova in this weird external dimension or maybe it's in the destroyed Shinra HQ lab, who knows at this point. Um, you will see above the character UI on the right side Red 13's head is sticking out but it's actually not uh, in the party here if you play the trailer at this part and pay close attention you will see him roaming around the battlefield so the question here is what is his actual role in this battle and in part 1 of the Final Fantasy 7 remake is he maybe just an NPC character that is um, going around the battlefield of various battles and does actions on his own without you being able to control him? That remains to be seen. Let me just quickly uh, pull up uh, Exhibit B. Exhibit B is this little scene here where Aerith and Red 13 are finishing off a normal enemy. At least this was a normal enemy in the first part of the game. Maybe there is an alternative boss monster battle um, that will happen where uh, th this boss monster looks similar to normal en enemies you will fight in the game, who knows. But what is um, interesting to note here that you see no character UIs being shown. So the question here is was Red 13 actually involved in this battle at all? Or is this just a cutscene that will play if you defeat this monster or boss monster and Red 13 will always appear um, at the end of the battle regardless if he was uh, involved uh, in the party that finished off this monster or not. So let me um, tell you about my little uh, tinfoil hat or conspiracy theory here. I think what maybe can happen is that Red 13 will not be a playable character in the first part of the Final Fantasy VII Remake. The Final Fantasy VII Remake will be split in several parts, but we don't know how many parts uh, the whole game will uh, end up. And maybe, just maybe, Square Enix is planning uh, to use Red 13 as a hook for you to purchase part 2 where he will be actually playable and in part 1 he's just some kind of NPC character that will assist you in the battle and do actions on his own. My fear here is that um, if Square Enix uh, sees an increase in sales uh, for part 2 or the sales will not drop at all or very little that they will actually um, continue to use this tactic and make Yuffie, Sid and Vincent um, kind of hook characters at the end of certain parts uh, and then make them playable for the next part so you buy the next part. So let me know what you think about this little theory of mine. Maybe um, the whole thing will uh, resolve itself when the next or final trailer uh, will drop before the release and we'll actually going to see um, Red 14 being involved in some of the battles. So um, like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit the notification button and follow me on my Twitch channel. Uh, until then, um, please take care and see you next time.